here I am on Roanoke Island, in the city of the Outer Banks of North Carolina. And I've come across the most dangerous creature known to man, the common ground squirrel. I'm not sure what he's doing there, but I'm about to give chase. <laughs> Foolish ground squirrel. He's just sitting there looking at me. I keep flipping his little paws around. You have to go after him. Come here, squirrel. Come on with me, buddy. <laughs> You're a little guy. Common gray. What are you doing? Whoa. You little spook. <laughs> and off he goes. Thus concludes the excitement for the afternoon. It doesn't get much more exciting than chasing a common ground squirrel. Except for the fact that this was the first place where any English Persian was born in the entire New World, otherwise known as America. Now this is the lost colony of Roanoke. They were lost and never came back. Or when they came back to look for them, they were gone. But according to this here tablet, it says that this woman named Virginia Dare was the first ever white English person born here. And this is the Fort Raleigh Historic Center, Visitor Center, Gatehouse and whatnot. And, uh, oh no, it's pretty neat. A little earthen fort over there that was like 430 years old, which is about as old as it gets in the Americas. Now, outside of that, oh yeah, this Raleigh fellow is the guy who settled this. Raleigh's Virginia. There's this little seal. 1584, he came back over here. Or no, 1587, he came back. 1584 is when the 115 or 16 of them were dropped off, and then when they came back, they were gone. Now, the theories for them disappearing include Lost Colony. A hurricane swept them away, the Spanish killed them, the Indians killed them, they moved inland, and or uh, some sort of disease wiped them out. But all things considered, this is a very neat area. Oh yes, it was also a spot of the Underground Railroad during the Civil War time, as you can see. In any case, that is all for now.